Vocal Softcats is one of the major highlights of iOS 18. Using this brand new accessibility feature, you can create a wide range of custom phrases to trigger your preferred actions. From a series shortcut to a system action to an accessibility feature, it is equipped to let you perform a variety of actions quickly on your device. Recently, many users have reported that the vocal shortcuts is not working on their devices. If this issue has troubled you as well, I have got you covered with some handy fixes. That said, let's get started. First off, I would recommend you to ensure that you have perfectly set up and verified the vocal shortcuts on your iPhone or iPad. Bear in mind that creating a vocal shortcut requires you to verify a phrase by speaking it three times. If you don't go through the verification phase, the shortcut will remain incomplete and therefore won't work at all. So make sure to keep this important thing in your mind. Then I would suggest you to delete all the existing vocal shortcuts and create new ones with precision, wiping out all the redundant shortcuts and creating new ones from scratch and with precision may help you get rid of all the miscellaneous glitches. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then select accessibility. Then choose vocal shortcuts. Then you have to tap on the edit button at the top right. And now you have to tap on the red button to the left of the shortcut that you want to get rid of and then hit the delete button on the right. You have to repeat these same quick steps to eliminate each and every shortcut. And then you have to tap on the done button at the top right corner of the screen to confirm. And then you have to reboot your device and then head into the settings app. Then choose accessibility and after that select vocal shortcuts. Then you have to tap on set a vocal shortcuts and then you have to select a preferred action and after that you have to enter a custom phrase and verify it. And then you have to speak that custom phrase to check if the vocal shortcut gets activated. If the issue persists, disable and re-enable vocal shortcuts on your device. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then choose accessibility. Then select vocal shortcuts. And then you have to disable the toggle for vocal shortcuts. And then you have to restart your device. And when your device has rebooted, go back to the accessibility setting and turn on vocal shortcuts. A software bug might also be behind the mouse functioning of the vocal shortcuts. If that happens to be the case, a timely software update will help you resolve the problem. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then select general. Then you have to choose software update and then you have to download and install the latest update. If the vocal shortcuts continue to ill function on your device, factory reset your device. By erasing the custom settings and bringing everything to the default state may help you troubleshoot the misfiring shortcuts. To do so, open the settings app on your iPhone or iPad. Then select general. After that, you have to scroll down to the bottom of the screen and choose Transfer a Reset iPhone or iPad. Then select Reset. Then choose Reset All Settings and confirm the action. And that's pretty much it. So, these are the best tips and tricks through which you will be able to fix vocal shortcuts not working problem on iPhone and iPad. Hopefully, you have gotten the better of the problem. If you found this video helpful, do like, consider it, and I'll see you in the next video with more such handy tips and tricks. Till then, stay safe and happy. Bye.